I know. Come on. Stay here, okay? Just don't move. Thank you, Selena. Don't thank me yet. <sighs> Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? <sighs> what? Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible, and painkillers do not solve the problem. You weren't gonna take them down on your own. They would have killed you. Yeah, I'll be sure to keep that in mind. Suddenly so agreeable. <laughs> I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I was just trying to help you, Selena. I didn't ask for your help. <laughs> well, I didn't ask for yours either, but here we are. Touche. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. <sighs> I'm sorry I messed things up for you back there. I know. I'm used to it anyway. There's no such thing as a fresh start. Oh, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Yeah, well, you've got most of Gotham behind you on that. Well, not most. Maybe half. Just trying to be optimistic. <laughs> Cut it out. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something just beneath the surface. You're wrong. There are good people out there. Honest people. Care to introduce me to one? Come on, Bruce. Even you have your secrets. Those things you hide from the world and won't let anyone else see. I don't have any secrets from you. You know, I have heard that a thousand times. But you might be the first to actually mean it. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I can. That's not all you are. I think that's just what you want people to believe. You put a lot of faith in someone who doesn't deserve it. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but... I've taken plenty from good people, too. But for what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? The high is nice, but it wears off. Then you look around and see... Nothing. 
So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. You're not alone, okay? I'm here for you. Thanks, Bats. Hmm. I was hoping for something more than that. Do I have to do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? Let me help you. Mm. It's what you do best, isn't it? Are you trying to tease me, Bats? Is it working? Hey there. I'm starving. Well, I guess that means I'm making breakfast. Wow. You even know how to work a toaster, rich kid? I am offended. Oh, too bad. I think there might be bagels in the fridge. Would definitely check expiration dates on anything. Before you think about putting it in your mouth. Bruce? Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if... if you were... I'm sorry, I didn't mean to worry you, Alfred. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. You got something to say, Alfred? I'm not judging you. Sounded like you were. I wouldn't dream of it. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around. If she's trustworthy, you may not have another chance. Yeah, um... That's a smart idea. I'll see what I can find. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. She can afford to eat anywhere, and she still chooses Chinese takeout. That isn't even the good place. Pretty strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight, though. They could use something like this. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petrarca. Hm. Didn't take her for a romantic. 
What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. There you are. Uh, I hope she didn't break anything. <sighs> Vacation spots are just marks on her burglary checklist. Looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. Ah. Harvey. Hey. I, uh, I brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. If you want me to go, I'll go. But I have to get this out. Bruce? What the... Seriously. What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I spent the night here. That's it. You... <laughs> I can't believe this! Down. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... <sighs> so stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me! Not if it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? Harvey, I'm sorry. For what? We have nothing to be sorry for. I don't answer to him, and neither do you. He... he will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just... get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them! He can't. Are you ready to die on that altar? I may go down for what my father did, but I won't take her down with me. She'll be fine. Ah, oh, funny. Thinking you have a choice. Thinking you can save the people around you. Thinking you could do what Harvey couldn't! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! No! No! Oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. Yeah. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who am I? This isn't you. Just calm down! <laughs> Shut up! Jesus, Harvey. Of course. Gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it. One way or another. Uh, how about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No. No, it really isn't. Selena, looks like you're first. Yeah, always getting in the middle of things. Stay the hell away from me. The call's already been made. Harvey. Bruce. No, I don't want to hurt you. This isn't, they turned their backs on you. 
Harvey, put the knife down! <sighs> Selena! <sighs> He's gonna hurt someone. You know we can take him out. <sighs> Have you lost your mind? <laughs> no. <sighs> Harvey! You need <sighs> to calm down. What are you doing? No going back now. Harvey, that's enough. Oh, God. Please. I don't want to be alone, Bruce. Please, not with him. I can't. Oh, God, I can't listen to him. You're not alone. We're right here. Okay? Yeah, I am. I am. I am. My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I... I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. He's my friend, Selena. I'm not going to abandon him. He needs professional help. Help you can't give it's him. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> so much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. Yeah, you're right. It's not safe to stay here. And I'm not sure I'm gonna find another place with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. <coughs> yeah. That means you too. <sighs> we won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. Uh, I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. <sighs> Great. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. Maybe you're right. This could be my chance to expose Oswald for who he really is. Let Gotham know he's a part of the Children of Arkham. Exactly. You better get going. I've got some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding better and better by the minute. I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've, uh, We've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. And please, Bruce, try to be on your best behavior. The very best. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name, now would we? I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. 
a step to regaining what you're being forced to give up. You're right. This is my legacy, and the only reason I'm putting up with this charade. Yes. Well, as long as you cooperate, I suppose your motivation is irrelevant. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shiner? Regina wanted me to cover it up with makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. But here I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. Mr. Cobblepot. All in good fun, honestly. A thrown punch is just water under the bridge. Right, Bruce? Boys are just being boys and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. Sorry for hitting you, Oswald. It was wrong. Uh, uh, I... Thank you, Bruce. I appreciate you being such a professional. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone. And thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, and taking everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. No, dear heart. Not even close. We have no one's going to follow you around and take pictures now. It'd almost be sad if you were so bloody handsome. I know who you really are, Oz. And I'm going to expose you. Oh, knowing and proving are two very different things, Bruce. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to meet the future of Gotham. What the Waynes built would not have been possible without the Cobblepots, Oswald. I suppose you deserve it as much as I do. Bloody right I do. Glad you're coming around to my way of thinking. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how Old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh yeah, and I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it, aren't you, Bruce? I know you're lying, Oswald. You don't know anything. I wouldn't lie about this, I promise. Story's too good for that. But suit yourself. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. <sighs> I've been asked here today to lie to you, to regurgitate a script prepared by the company, all to hide the fact that I have been forced out. But I won't do that. I will not lie to save face. One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. My father wasn't the only one involved in this corruption. Mayor Hill and Carmine Falcone. It was a system designed for their gain. Dodging the blame? Is it gonna do you any good, mate? Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Uh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior. Today. Nice After statement. All, he is the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. It must be quite hard we can talk about it later. Later? Work. No. This needs to happen right now. Dropped your pen. That's not... <coughs> 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 I should know. I'm sure some of you remember the former party of Cobblepot Park. You feel that? Now it stands That's the drug taking hold of you. A testament Don't to fight the it. Terrible thing you. To Gotham. You're with the children of Arkham. Of the dark no. I am Something the children of Arkham. So I think it's time you knew my real name. 
I am going to be Arkham. And you already know the penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, a smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! Someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That is why, regrettably, I made the decision to have my old friend hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Batman, the children of Arkham, the Penguin. Doesn't Gotham already have enough deranged criminals terrorizing its streets? I believe that Gotham citizens deserve to be safe. That they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. With the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman?